time. But even now, my mother still talks about the history. So I think, you know, even though we're moving forward, I agree, but our foundation is our history. Thinking about the resilience uh, that Councilman was just speaking about, my mother still talks about it today. She still talks about that, the, what Fairfield stood for, the prominent blacks that, was, that were here and working in uh, the steel plant. She talks about that today. And that is the history that so many of our ancestors, um, they stand on. And you know, I don't think we can erase that. And I think that is gonna be the foundation that helps us to rise again uh, uh, in this master plan because what you have to understand is that there are so many that are in the community that's still living on that. They, they understand where, you know, they, they are committed. They're committed to what we're doing. In the school district, we build on that history. We try to talk about it and, uh, you know, we want our students to be proud of the school, the school district that they're going to and we want them to be proud of the city. Uh, we do know that, you know, there's it, things dealing with the crime and all of that. Some of our teachers, you know, sometimes they're, they're trying to hurry and get out of the city and all. And we talk to them and say, uh, one thing, Mr. Curry, always we, when we stand before them, we say you can never even think of anything ever happening in our school district because it doesn't. We safeguard those things. And so we try to let them know and be proud of, the, of where they are as well, proud of where they work. Um, we try to bring things there for them, thinking about um, Cahaba Medical. You know, we have a medical clinic in all of our schools, except the high school, but they can go right across the street to, um, you know, um, um, C.J. Donald and, the, you know, go to the clinic the same way. So it's just that we're trying to make sure that they understand that everything can be right here that they need. You know, if an employee gets sick, they can go right down the hall to the doctor. And then even open our doors uh, at Forest Hill De Development Center, we open our doors to a full clinic for the whole community. Because it wasn't about just having it for our employees, but we shared that our facility for the community. You know, so we have a full open clinic that anyone in the community can go to within our schools. And it was all about how do we do this together, coming together as one, in unity, that we're not separate entities. We're not a business over here, a church over here, a school district over here. We're all in this together. And that's gonna be the main thing that stands and that we kind of we kind of stand on that it's not we have to all be together doing this thing we all have to have the same vision of that what are we doing to have revitalize because when we thought about the, the health uh, facility we didn't just think about just for the students we thought about the community so even if a business comes well how, you know doing it for the whole community and that's the main thing and just kind of building off the history